Well, would you look at that? Man, we got snow out there. Now, well, let's go see what the finances is this morning before we go and uh, put away some equipment and plow some snow. Look at the account finances. Uh-oh. Cash? Assets? Negative 74,000. Oh. Oh, goodness. This isn't good. Holy cow. I paid $132,000 in invoices. No wonder I'm broke. So, I've been trying to play the export business so here here's my uh, warehouses I have rented have one in Argentina have one in Netherlands United States and Venezuela and so every time I'm like okay soybeans let's go look at the soybean market you know that that price looks fairly good right there see ooh, I guess we could sell some product Argentina Let's see, we need some moolah, even though this is not a great price right now, not for it, but I think we're going to, do, wait a second, do I have, yes, so I have product in Argentina right here. It looks like I lost one liter somewhere. Ah, they're going to have to pay me back for that. No way. So I'm actually kind of excited because I keep moving stuff around and I never, it, it's always, so they always want you to buy. So this is sell. At first I was like, oh, this is where you sell your product. Hey, want to sell, they want to sell your product. But when I looked at it, sell orders. You know, when you read that, you don't read the small print. That's like, oh yeah, sell it there. No. All right, so we have sold a few product right there. So we filled that order. So uh, let's see if our warehouse. So our warehouse shows that. I don't know if that ends up going directly into our bank or how that goes. So it's a little bit confusing. I don't really see the money right away. So let's see. So we also have one in the Netherlands here. Soybeans. It would be nice if it just stay on soybeans. So they're not selling anything in Venezuela. That's a fun country to say. So they're not buying any orders either. Hmm. I do have these warehouses. I do have a lot to play with. So I'm hoping that gets us back up to price. So why we are so broke is we got more land so if you see right here uh, field 68 is ours I did bid on field uh, 59 so 59 is really close to ours so did I just before we get out of here make sure I pay my invoices so they're all paid look at all that money I just have thrown out no wonder I'm so broke I am like broke beyond belief so field 59 let's we're looking at our map right here is right here so uh really uh squad basically undercut us right there last minute bid for that field we did get field 68 so it kind of benefited us that he did that but it is a little nerve-wracking i i guess he got me back let's just say that but Field 68 is a huge field. I think that'll be awesome to farm that. Easy to farm, huge field. We'll go look at that quickly. What, I left my front door open? I wonder if it felt cold last night. All right, so good thing I got that plow. Oh, wow. I guess I gotta put some equipment away. So uh, yeah, we'll get, I'm gonna put this equipment away really quick, just so, and then I'm gonna start plowing. It looks like a lot of it dried that's 
fell on the rocks here, but I do have to plow a little bit. So we're going to get that done, put this equipment away. So hopefully this uh, 8R will start here. I was working on the planter here. That's why I had it out and, uh, last night trying to get it ready for spring planting. But looks like I should have probably put it away when I got done. Let's see if this starts. <laughs> It's gonna start or what? Uh oh. It's not gonna start. Alright. No, I was hoping for a good old cold start, but not so much. Alright, so we. There we. There we go. Lift that up. Start folding this up here. Sure, nothing breaks so I don't know if we don't make a lot of money I guess we're gonna have to sell this planner and uh, lease a planner for spring depending on how much we make in our soybean sales we're really kind of losing a lot of money on uh, the market so let's just say uh, I didn't play that correctly at all Every time I move some soybeans around, it ends up, uh, the for sale disappears on me, so, oh well. We're gonna move this in here, park this in here. Man, that wind is really blowing. It's blowing that snow right through that door. Get this in here and back it up. Back it up till it sounds expensive back there. Oh, oh, right there. That's where it's expensive at. Straighten that out a little bit. Help my OCD. All right. So, uh, yeah, we got a little bit of gap there. Close these doors so snow doesn't blow in this building. There we go. I, oh, wow, I got to get them wagons in, too. Yeah, we'll get them wagons in. I think I'll use a little blue so I don't have to unhitch the planter here. Oh, little blue started up. See that deer? Little blue can do it. It was just uh, under overhang, so... Beans, uh, these wagons are empty. I think little blue can get it done. I think little blue can get it done. Famous last words, maybe. I really wish I had a loader bucket for a little blue here so I can move around some snow, which would be nice. Oh, not far enough yet. Hitch that up. All right, plug that in. Make sure we're all plugged in. Yep, right here. Yep, we are good to go. See if little blue. I'm gonna whip it around right here. Uh oh, sliding a little bit. Ooh, ooh. Yep, yep. Little blue, you can do it, little blue. There we go. Sure, am glad that I ended up hauling earlier, so that way I don't have to haul in the winter. That would have been bad. Get. This little blue through the door here. So uh, we weren't able to plant that uh, our new field 68, of course, because we just purchased it not that long ago, to be honest. I don't think I lined it up correctly, so I'm gonna try to pull it through again just to see if it lined up. Oh man, oh, 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 oh man, little blue is all over the place here. All right, get on this nice clean rock, there we go. It's amazing how heavy them trailers are, even empty. Get it going around here. Probably need to slow down a little bit, little blue. Go. 
go. God. Oh, oh, oh. Ah. Sliding around all over the place. Wanted to line them up, but it's not getting really lined up this time around. Alright, we will pull that in here. There we go. Get them trailers under the overhang. See if we can do some donuts. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, not doing so much. Not even turning. You would think. Man, I wanted to do some sweet donuts, but we're not doing anything fun anymore. So it doesn't appear that our front really has the traction for Flow Blue. It's alright. Get over here, and uh, I just think I had to put in the seed tender. That should be the last item that has to go in. I'm gonna snow plow some snow, and I have a special surprise for Squad. Uh, just because, you know, he wants to make sure he undercuts me there. I think I have a special little surprise for him. Put that up there. There we go. It's all in fun. It's all in fun. But I do have a special surprise for him. Back this up. sure we miss some posts there. Don't want to hit them, that's for sure. Alright. There we go. Like I said, I should have did this last night. I saw that there was snow in the forecast. I was just working too late on the planner last night and uh, just kind of forgot about it and went to bed. So, shame, shame on me. Get a little blue put away now. Oh, oh. There we go. Like I said, it would be kind of nice if I had a bucket for a little blue there. So I can move around some snow. Might have to think about purchasing that later on. Alright, so uh, this is why I got the snow plow. Because I kind of figured there's going to be snow coming down here. So let's utilize that. Start this up. All right, raise that up a little bit. There we go. Shut our garage door. There we go. I suppose I should just uh, scrape our little pathway here into our other field, just in case. That's done. Yeah. I think I could do a little bit better job right here at the beginning portion. Go. Get this. Get that scraped out right there. Like we could probably do a little bit more on the other side too. Scrape this. I do plan on scraping this row just in case we need something. Alright, so I'm gonna scrape down this road here quickly. anybody happen to come down here do want to do one special service but primarily I'm doing this just to make sure Grant Austin and Buck can get to their field over here don't know exactly how that works how you get three people in on your farm over here I'm gonna put that like that 
Yeah, there we go. There we go. I know there isn't a lot of snow to deal with here. My plan is to basically put a little barrier up on their their new field here. So it's all in fun. It's not going to really hurt them. So they'll be able to easily go over it with a tractor. But maybe it's it's just a little fun for them. So let them know that uh, hey, we all know what you did. So so we rented the snowplow truck from the local community here to help us out. Way easier to use this than our little pickup truck. So we're gonna try to use this. Uh, we told them basically we're gonna use it to clear off some roads, but uh, really I plan on uh, using it to uh, put a big old snow pile drift right in front of Grant's new field. All in fun, like I said, all in fun. It's actually a pretty good deal that uh, Grant ended up purchasing that field because we would be really broke if he didn't. It's just only bad because it is so close to our farm. So that's the only downfall for it, but uh, other than that, it was a fair purchase by Grant even though he came in right at the last moment. You proved me wrong, the late bird gets the worm. So. sure I just hit a guardrail oh man that was almost a kidney shot yeah I'm not good at this uh, whole scraping thing so we're trying to scrape all these uh, county roads right here and then uh, hopefully uh, at the end of it all I will uh, put a nice big drift in there for uh, the squad team up there going down here so of course we're gonna leave Spencer TV's team alone over here because uh, they were fair in their deal with uh, purchasing a field right next to us couldn't purchase that even if we wanted to anyways but I don't know if we are gonna treat Grant's team the same let's see take some of the snow from this grass field right here just to help out the cause here. There we go. This is working way better than the snow plow we got. So happy I went down and I borrowed this. Even though I don't know if they know this is what I'm using it for but uh this is fun all in fair game anyways all right it looks like they could possibly get in over here so I'm going to put a little bit of mound here I don't think I can put the same amount of mound over here than uh, 
on the other side, but we'll have to do what we have right now. We don't have a lot of snow right now, so making this a little bit more challenging. Roads are pretty slippery right now, so making it a little bit more challenging too. Alright, we're going down here again. Just to make sure, I want to make sure there's not an entrance on this side of this field. I know they would give me a lot. Oh, there is. Oh, bummer. So, looks like we're going to have to do some more uh, snow plowing. This field has more entrances than any other field. Oh, wait. Is this an entrance? Let's see here. Oh, for sure. Oh, there we go. There's an entrance right here. All right, so that's the second one. Ooh, looks like we kind of missed this little corner right here. Well, actually, this is the third little entrance we blocked. This field ha is very uh, unfortunate for us. Uh, it has a lot of basically entrances. It's kind of as a bummer because it means that we have to plow more snow just to play with the team a little bit. Trust me, I know this this snow isn't gonna last long enough to really prevent them from getting in here and plowing, so yeah, I'm pretty sure they can get over them drifts pretty easy. Let's make sure we don't have another entrance over here oh man looks like we still have another one this field is very conveniently uh, entrance let's just say that and if they can't get into this field they can always rent this snow plow and basically get into it themselves so how it open themselves. I mean, it, it's not gonna really give them that much of grief. I'm not really preventing their farm growth by any reason. Just playing with them a little bit here. And got. Hopefully, it snows a lot more and helps me with this whole project. It's been snowing all morning long. Like you. The snow melts pretty quick around here, so I don't even know if these drifts will even be there by the time they get up here with a plow and start plowing. There we go. That's the last entrance. Didn't really do that one too great. Maybe put a little bit more. Ooh, getting a little slippery out here. If they find this entrance, I'm sure they'll be able to uh, get into their field here. Not too hard to get in that. Back to plowing the road here. So obviously they can get into their field pretty easily right over here. So I'm not really going to prevent them from getting into their field. Ooh, train doesn't stop for the snow, huh? Let's see how this thing is going to be a blizzard come by. Oh, I don't even see any snow getting kicked up. That's a bummer. Well, got a Snickers bar. Gonna have to wait 10 minutes. Doesn't look like they put one in here. Bummer.
like we got that county road done. We got squads, new field, entrances, uh, snow drift in. So hopefully we get a lot more snow to help out our uh, cause here and get them drifts a little bit higher so they will prevent a tractor. I'm just kidding. I don't mean any you know, harm to the squad's team, or do I? I don't know. But uh, thank you all for watching, and I will see you later over here on the FSN server. Catch you next time. Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, and share, and subscribe.